All right. It's Monday, Memorial Day, and uh, took off yesterday. Um, my brother's house, which I've just I've come to the realization that he does not have enough room uh, to take off safely. I'm just kind of pressing my luck there, and uh, so uh, we won't be doing that anymore. But the air was trash. I got up and um, immediately, almost immediately, just come back and landed. Uh, but I was wanting to fly up here to uh, Moss Lake. And uh, so the air should be better today. There's a little bit of a wind, but it's not like it was yesterday. That front's pretty much gone. <clears throat> so we got a nice, maybe about a, I don't know, four mile per hour south wind, which is a, a good direction from this park fly from so um, it's not constant so I'd like to get a little bit of breeze to come through here to help me take off but we'll see here all right guys said if uh, the air was good we would uh, try to go over here to the lake and maybe trim out and I put like uh, 10 liters in fuel so Taking off from my brother's house, it's it's just a couple miles from the lake. Um, I'm a little farther away, so we're gonna climb and see how the air is. See if I want to go that far. There's, I mean, as you see, there's so many good fields that kind of fly around in. I get up that way, it's a little more congested. <clears throat> um, I believe. kind of have a kind of a headwind going there and a crosswind, a uh, tailwind coming back. So far the air's uh Pull the mic up here to my mouth. I don't know how that first audio was. I moved it out of the way because I'm trying to hear, hear myself up and puff as I'm uh, taking off. So I kind of threw the mic down. A few little bumps, but it's uh, nothing compared to yesterday. Yesterday was just rough. So I don't know. Let's just. Uh, Plenty of fuel, really plenty of time. I believe we got an hour and a half to sunset. An hour and a half to sunset, and I got the strobe, so I mean, we got two hours and, uh, pending fuel. This will probably be the farthest trip I took. I have to look, I'm not sure how many miles it is as the bird flies, <coughs> or by road for that matter. Road just comes to an end, don't it? Try 
trying to think about what oh yeah I know what road this is Nice little field. I said I wasn't going to drop down in none of these fields, but here I am. Never flew these, so obviously, I'm. What am I doing? I'm looking for power lines. I don't see anything. Just a bunch of hay bales. Horses up here. We don't want to bother them. And we want to go this way anyway, so. Let's climb on back up here. Let's do a camera check. I tell you, this was, uh, like I said, I'd be about the farthest to travel just going out and back. So they're just going up and buzzing around, you know, within a few miles away. But I watched uh, that last leg of uh, Tucker God's Icarus race. And uh, I've, I've watched all of them probably twice. But I tell you what, it, when you get up here and start thinking about how you know, flying eight hours a day or so, several days in a row. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I get a little stressful. Um, just the planning going into it and flying, flying midday, and um, the mention just kind of wearing you out. All right. <clears throat> so, it doesn't take me long to, to see. And they're landmarks that I recognize. So I know where I'm at right up here. My brother's house is going to be right up here. Uh, there's the lake. You might be able to see it now. Right there in front of us. See those trees. We've had last year. We had some pretty bad wind storms come through, and he lost several big ones back into there. Hey! <laughs> it's a lot smoother. Hey, dog, dog. coming across there.
I've, I've flown this part right here before. I don't think I had my camera on. Um, this was last year, end of last year. Left. There were some houses, you know, that got took out. State bought them. It's not buttery smooth down here. I'd like to. I'd almost foot drag this if it was. be smooth and then I'll just kind of hit some bumps. It's like a little thunderhead trying to build up up there, ain't it? Woo! That dropped right there. Grading ends just right up here. Pop up over these lines and we might drop back down. These other lines go underneath it. There's some flag in there for a nice wind indicator for me. I appreciate that. There's some tall power lines right up there. So I gotta keep an eye on that. I don't have any flotation on, so uh, we're not going to get real crazy here. Surrounded by trees too, so not like there's a whole lot of outs. You see the ripples on the lake coming this way, so you know it's a nice breeze. And I can feel it headed right into it. Many outs. So, uh, I'd like to get lower, but I'm not going to.
shape of a heart. Y'all see that? That's too perfect to be uh, not be deliberate. But, uh, horse ring. <laughs> 